In this video, you'll see how to link to your registration pages or group pricing page on your site. You can do this by adding a link on your navigation menu, or you can link to your registration pages and forms on any page, post, or custom post type on your WordPress site. So in my WordPress dashboard, if I go to Member Press and Memberships, you can see here that I have two memberships set up on my site. I'll click my basic membership, and you can see the link to this membership's registration page here. And then if I go to Groups, I have those memberships in a group. I'll click to edit my group, and you can see here the link to my pricing page. I'll open it in a new tab, and you can see that here. So the first thing I'll do is show you how to add these links to your site navigation. So on my site, I wanna add a link here that people can click to buy my membership or memberships. So back in the WordPress dashboard, I'll go to Appearance here on the left sidebar and Menus. Now, the first thing I'll show you is how to add the link to my group pricing page to the menu. And then I'll show you how to add a link to my basic membership registration page. So here on the menus page, you'll notice these items here, groups and memberships. If you don't see those at first, go up here to screen options at the top and make sure groups and memberships are selected. So I'm gonna come down here and expand this groups item and then I'll see my group, basic and pro. I'll check that and click add to menu. And I can see it's been added to my menu. I'll click and drag it where I want it on my site, right here. And then I'll click this down arrow to expand this. Here on the navigation label is where you can change the actual link text that will appear on your site navigation. So for mine, I'm gonna change it to sign up. Then here at the bottom, I'll click save menu. And I see that it's been saved. Now I'll go back to my site, go to the home page, and I'll see that sign up's been added to my menu. And if I click on sign up, it takes me to my group pricing page. Now, going back to the menus, I'll go back to sign up and click to remove it. Now, I'm gonna show you how to add just a single membership registration page. You might want to do this if you only have one membership level, for example, on your site. So, I'll go to memberships here and check my basic membership, click add to menu, and click and drag it here. And then I'll change the navigation label to membership. You could change this to anything you want. I could make it sign up or purchase a membership or anything like that. Then I'll click save menu. And go back to my site. Hit refresh. And I see my link here. I'll click on it. And it takes me to my basic membership registration page. Then I'll go back to the WordPress dashboard. Now I'm just gonna go over a couple more use cases for linking to your group pricing page or membership registration pages. You may want to just add a simple link to one of your registration pages on a WordPress page, for example. So I'll go to Member Press, Memberships, and I'll use my basic membership as an example. I'll highlight the URL here and click Copy. And then I'll go to Pages on the left sidebar click Add New. I'll give it a name. And then here, I could just add some text. Highlight it. And link to my registration page here. Now, if I click Publish and view the page, you can see my link here. And when I click on it, it goes to my basic registration page. You can also embed registration forms on pages, posts, and custom post types as well. Here on the Member Press Support Documentation page, on the bottom, you see a list of short codes you can use. You could use this first short code to link to your registration pages in a similar way that we just did. And using the second short code will let you embed the actual registration form on a page, post, or custom post type. You can also find these short codes per membership edit page. So going back to my WordPress dashboard, 
I'll go to MemberPress and Memberships, and then I'll collect my basic membership. And then here, under Registration, you can click this link here, Membership Shortcodes. And here are the shortcodes. So I'll copy this shortcode here, and go back to my page, and paste it here. Then I'll save the page, and I'll open my page in a new tab. And I see my sample page with the basic registration form added to it. And that's it. You've now seen a few ways to link to your registration and group pricing pages on your WordPress site. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.